which was the first time you'd been there. And I think the the thing that impressed me the most was how you met everyone and they knew who you were almost by instinct. You know, that yes, um, you know, at, as a matter of fact, uh, uh, some of them have the idea that I was coming. And, you know, after we reached there, there were friends to meet us at the airport. And um, news go around quite fast and everything was just marvelous. I don't even like to talk about it because it let me with so much eagerness to return. You know, because Senegal to me, I'm telling you, it's like my home for the first time. I, I've never been to any place that I feel so comfortable like I did in Senegal. You know, so um, I'm looking forward to we want to go back then but we haven't fixed the time, you know, the exact time, but we have it in mind to return hmm. as soon as possible. And then you'll be hopefully shipping your record there as well as oh, yes. Jamaica. Oh, and yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Sure enough. Yeah. Sure enough. And the feelings, I guess, that everywhere you went for Bob were just stronger than everywhere everywhere you know people everywhere i would say if they don't even know bob personally here you know they hear of, of him and um everywhere you go people they just show you that amount of love that they have in them because from the reaction of what i have seen you know you know that those people dearly love bob and I mean, most everywhere I go, people love Bob. It's like I say, anybody that don't love Bob is the devil. That's the way I put it. Anybody that don't love him is the devil. No. Mm -hmm. But everybody loves Bob, mostly. But I wouldn't, I wouldn't say the world loves him. Jah is the creator of heaven and earth. He is the giver of all things. Yet still, regardless of what you have given to man and done to man, man still fighting against him. They go on doing the wrong things. So, I mean, you can't please everybody. You just can't. That's true, and that's probably a good place to mention Catch a Fire. Um, I've read the book and read some of it while we were in, in at Sunsplash, it seemed to be an appropriate place, and then a little more in New York, which is even more appropriate. Oh. Um, is it fact or is it fiction? And can you tell the difference? I, uh, most of what is in it is not facts. You know, I don't know why or how or where Timothy White got the information them that he put in that book. But I am... Um, Powerfully upset with the book and him of the things that he talk about us. And these things are not true. I mean, if I go out there and I uh, say something, and the way he put it, he put it as if he's, I am the one that tell him all these things in there. You think I could be sitting there talking to you as a young man? And, I mean, if I couldn't have anything good to talk to you about, then I wouldn't talk to you none at all. You see what I'm saying? And when Timothy White came and sit and he asked a few questions and I would answer him and when he done it, he take it and put it and oh, I like I told him you, are, you had too much seasoning to it and that's what spoiled the whole broth. I told him that. You see, because I don't appreciate the things that he write, about, uh, write in there about me. I really don't, neither my family. I, and the way he put my picture, I do not like it. You understand me? I think that man hates us. He hate us. He tell me that he love Bob. We will soon see whether I love Bob or not. We will soon see. Because true love never die and nothing can overflow that. But we will soon see. But I don't see, in my opinion, I don't see nothing in that book that Timothy White has written in there that is reality. I know what is reality in there. And I know what is foolishness or garbage, in other words. And he can... Stuff it, eat it, or do anything you want to do with it. I'm not interested in it 
in one way or the other because that book is condemned where I am concerned. I hate it. He belittle us. That's what he done. And I hate that. I don't like nobody really take me um, less than what I am. I am a woman and I am I'm a woman of dignity and I like people to handle me that kind of a way just the same way how I would like I handle people. Because if I know that I'm going to do something or say something to you that you don't like, then mom is my word, I don't say it. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, and moreover, if you say you love somebody, you ain't gonna hurt them. I am not a hypocrite. I am a true born Rastafari woman with a pure, clean heart from the Almighty God. That's who I am. People don't really understand, but that's who I am. And when I go out there and I give my heart out to you, it's all my heart, everything, everything is coming from the heart. I am a Judah, all right. And that's who I am. If I'm going to do for you, nothing on earth can stop that. And it's coming from the heart. If I'm not going to do it, then don't bother me. Don't bother me. I won't. So what you doing, what you saying about the book now? You say you, um, you like the book, did you say No, that? I said that I really couldn't tell fact from fiction there. It didn't look like it was fact all the no, way through. No, I told you that. But what you see is like, um, what you would call it, fiction then. But he put a whole different name to it or whatever, I don't know. He put all these names and like um, some of the names, they're not even right. I don't know where he get his information and from some of the names, them are false names. I don't know where Timothy White get these things from. And I think he don't have no respect for me as a woman. Like I ask him, would you interview your mother and interview her like that and write about her like that in that book? Of course he couldn't answer because I dare him answer, he could not. He's nothing but a hypocrite, that's who he is. Telling, about, telling people about um, how he, um, he uh, is a friend of the family. He pay a man a thousand dollars to bring the man, to, to bring him here to talk to me and, and I'm not a hooligan. I'm not a wolf nor a tiger. I might be a lion, but I don't really jump and scratch no one. Unless they really put it in my way. But he pay a man a thousand dollars to bring him here. And it's because he know he had done something wrong. That's why he was afraid to come by himself this time. And when he, um, he interviewed me, in, he put it in the book there. When he interviewed me in um, Delaware, he said that Bob, every time he asked Bob, where is his mother? Bob say his mother is in Africa. And until he found me in Wilmington. If he had told me that when he came there that Bob had told him that, then he couldn't cross the threshold of my, my doorstep to come in my house. Okay, he came and they took pictures of me. They, um, they, 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 they interviewed me. And he said he was going to send me a copy of the book. He didn't. Well... At one time he called and I said, I don't want to talk to you um, because like um, I didn't, you didn't, um, you, you, you promised to send me some pictures which you didn't. And then I think he believed within himself that I was really mad at him, which I don't, I don't mad with people. If somebody hurt me and I speak very frankly and firm to you, but I don't keep you in my heart, no. And he thought then I was mad at him and he paid that guy to bring him here just to talk to me. But after I came and found out that was a, I was a human being just like him or anybody else, if he is, then he found out that he didn't want no one to convey him to approach me. And then they are having a lawsuit someplace now. I don't appreciate um, uh, uh, Timothy White. I do not. We spoke to Rita down in uh, at Sunsplash, and she said that she was going to be writing her own book. Of course, when we ready, we do our own thing, and then it's going to it's going to look what the all the mess that he's saying out there going to look foolish, because it will be an entire different thing from 
what the whole real story is all about. So how can you be confusing the people like that? Yeah. My impression was that uh, if you didn't know anything about Bob and, and the whole story, it would read like a great adventure story. But and then he might run yeah. around, see somebody yeah. out here, and ask them some question, might give them a few pennies. They don't know what they are talking mm -hmm. about, but for money, they do any people do anything. You give them a few pennies here, a few pennies there, and they talk a whole bunch load of foolishness, I must say. And when he's done, he's going to put, print them in book, and then giving me thanks and giving my family thanks for what? I just want people to tell me thanks. If they have to, and I don't even want them to tell me thanks, is when I give them something, I never give him anything yet. He told me I'm charitable. He don't know. I never offer him anything. It's only the people who I offer anything or do any good to could say, Mrs. Booker is a charitable woman. He's going to say it off words. You have to know what you're talking about. I'm not saying I'm not charitable. I'm not saying I'm not good. I am. But how can you? It's only he who feels he knows. How can you say Mrs. Booker is a good woman and Mrs. Booker never offer you anything? Mrs. Booker, all you say, you only see Mrs. Booker. You don't know Mrs. Booker no more, answer. Hmm? You could neither, neither say I'm good or bad. You only have to say, she looked to be a good person. From the way maybe I talk, from the person's action, the reaction that you get, because every action, there's a reaction. In every action, there is. You see, so it's just from the person. You see, um, I don't know. I don't know. But when we are ready to put out our book, then this will be the book. But not until then. Everything where you're going out there, sir, is just scraps and sketches and lies. Hmm? Mm -hmm. The reality has to come from up the roof. And we'll see that hopefully fairly soon. Yes. Nothing done before the time. When the time right. come, John, everything mm. happen. Everything of its time. Yes. But I hope it will be soon. But you know, it don't take to write a book, it takes time. You know that. Uh, it takes time. No, what about the um, the church? Has there been any more progress on that? Well, um, we haven't done anything so far yet. Because like, um, we, um, you know, we're spending monies and we are not uh, accumulating any money yet. You know, we are doing videos and all the things them that, you know, you work with us and uh, all the progress, the pro uh, we try, we try hard. So I would say in a little, maybe soon, I w not for this year though, next mm -hmm. year. Next year we're starting. Mm 